Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the third. So, what are we going to do for a deck today? I don't think I'll use this one right over here. I haven't used this one in a while. So yeah, what do we, we what do we got for a message today? Now keep in mind the timing is fluid. So yeah, the timing is fluid. So what do we have for a message today? No, oh, I had one card come out. The Knight of Wands. Act now, think later. Things happening fast. Okay, this is a passionate entrance, passionate arrival, or something happening very, very fast. Somebody gets this desire to do something, and they typically, I mean, this is fearless individual. This person is going in with bats. I mean, that's got to be somebody that is fearless. I mean, to get in a situation where it's dangerous, somebody is, is really doing something that is crazy. Okay, this is crazy. <laughs> Gotta love that, huh? Um, ooh, magician. This is definitely doing something. So this is a doer. Somebody that is very skilled, capable, um, has faith. This is an inventor or a creator. Somebody that is very skilled at succeeding because they just do it so some, somebody's just gonna do something this is somebody that is very action oriented that you know has the resources uses their resources um taking action both of these cards are action cards so there's some sort of action that is going to be taken um fast something's going to happen fast as well Looks like there's somebody standing in a doorway of some sort. Standing in a doorway. You want to come in? You know, that kind of thing. Come on in. Oh, I guess those are it, huh? Ace of Swords reversed. Five of Pentacles, Empress reversed, right next to the Ace of Swords reversed, Six of Swords, King of Wands, Aries Leo Sagittarius. We have Aries Leo Sagittarius here a couple times. We have Taurus in Libra. We also have uh, somebody that has been abandoned, has been neglected with the five of pentacles left out in the cold, but needs help. Somebody needs help. It must be this empress in reverse. I'm about sick of seeing this empress in reverse. I'm telling you that right now. Uh, every time I put my hand up to my face, don't I? Mmm. Empress in reverse, ace of swords right next to it in reverse. So that's lack of communication, lack of awake awakening, no communication, uh, dishonesty. Somebody's being dishonest. They're not telling the truth. There could be somebody here that it looks like it's a female, a feminine energy that is being dishonest. It may not be a Taurus, could be somebody else, Taurus or a Libra. It could be anybody, you know, somebody that um, is very needy, clingy. Empress in reverse is somebody that doesn't take good care of anybody, um, including herself. But the this this King of Wands, this is a hero coming to save the day. So it's interesting. It is interesting. We could have somebody that is in some pain with the Empress reversed. Six of Swords is over there by the Knight of Wands. That is moving 
uh, moving, moving towards and going on a journey, taking a journey, taking a ride. Somebody could be arriving. They could be going somewhere. They're going somewhere. Somebody is going somewhere. They have neglected this. I don't know if they've neglected this empress in reverse or this empress is the empress in reverse is lack of growth, lack of fertility, um, a lack of love, lack of abundance. Um, powerless. Ace of Swords reversed is powerless. Loss of power. No no power. No communication. Maybe this Empress in reverse isn't communicating. This Empress. I gotta get another card for that. That Knight of Wands. That King of Wands is right next to the Empress in reverse. That's where it was. This pile fell out together. These cards that I'm laying down now is a little pile of cards. King of Wands takes action. This is a hero coming to save the day, right? Saving somebody, obviously, in the nick of time. This is in the nick of time. I don't know. Four of Pentacles reversed. That is opening up. Seven of Cups. Seeing clearly Seven of Cups reversed. A clear decision is being made. We have somebody here that is making a decision. They're making, their choice has been made. They've made their choice. They have made their choice. There is a female here that may have abandoned them, that may have neglected them, that may have ghosted them, that may not be communicating. She may not be very awakened. She may not be very loving. She may not be very motherly. I mean, the Empress in reverse is, I'm still about sick of it because now I feel sick again. Oh, jeez. Um, Four of Pentacles reversed. That is opening up, letting go. It's time to relax. Somebody has been holding on to something for materialistic reasons, for stability reasons. This is letting go, taking action, seeing clearly what the best choice is. There's been some sort of confusion. There's been a lot of options. This is making the choice, making the choice. So somebody is making a choice with that Seven of Cups reversed. Very passionate. I don't know what is going on, but this is action. It is taking action right now. I gotta go right now. This is action right now because it's in the nick of time before it's too late. Going somewhere right now. Somebody needs help. Now the King of Wands is typically a protector. Opening up. Making a choice. I gotta get another card on that Empress reversed. Kind of like contractions right there, huh? <laughs> gotta breathe. Gotta breathe. Just breathe. Magician reverse now. So the Empress in reverse is a feminine that is not communicating she's not giving anything she's not doing anything there's there's some sort of lies here there's definitely a female here i don't care what you guys say i honestly do not that is lying is not telling the truth this person is a master manipulator they use emotions maybe they even use their body to control a situation this is somebody that probably has affairs that has been a lying about affairs the magician in reverse is a liar somebody that is a pathological liar somebody could be dealing with a pathological liar and they can see it very very clearly It's probably not a Taurus or a Libra. It's probably somebody else. Somebody that may proclaim, proclaim to be an Empress, but they're not. Ace or Magician reversed. That's a no. No, 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 no.
four of cups reversed seizing a new opportunity upright there's been a missed opportunity somebody has been ignoring an opportunity they've been thinking about it reversed it's taking the opportunity taking a new opportunity emotionally fulfilling opportunity it's like i've been ignoring it i've been missing it i've been thinking about it now i'm taking it so somebody is taking a new opportunity they are they've they've ignored it for some time here they come because the knight of wands is action oriented and so isn't the king of wands this is something somebody that is absolutely fearless that is going to do something crazy because when you get yourself in with a pile of bats well what do you think about bats what i just heard was bat shit crazy sorry but that's what it looks like to me um I like crazy. <laughs> I shouldn't have said that. I'm sorry. But uh, anyhow, um, I'm probably going to have to do this one over. Um, strike that. Cut. Start over. Keep in mind that every word that comes out of my mouth is part of this reading. Somebody is cutting out an individual because there's no growth. Magician reverse next to the Empress reverse. There's no growth. There's no fertility. There's no tender loving care. The Empress and the upright loves and she loves big, 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 big. She's all abundant and all that beautiful but somebody is not with a situation it's not beautiful there's no growth there's, there's a lot of pain it's long overdue something is long overdue this this departure or whatever it is is long overdue going someplace else with the six of swords that is going someplace else we got somebody here that is going someplace else. They're telling somebody no. They can see very, very clearly now. There's been some sort of clarity. There's been some lies. This person has been dishonest. Now there's action that is about to be taken. We have an individual that is also being saved They're being saved. They're being protected. They're in the nick of time. This is like help. This is your help arriving. This is your hero. This is like a freaking hero. We could have a feminine here who um, doesn't trust. This feminine and the empress can mean so many things. I could go all day just on that one card. The empress in reverse is probably somebody that doesn't trust, that has been abused, that has been neglected, that has been protecting herself with that four of pentacles, needing to open up, needing to uh, choose another option. Somebody needs to choose another option. There's another option here with the Seven of Cups. That's that's options, but this is seeing clearly what the best option is. Somebody has been lying a lot. Going, moving, moving to a better place. We have somebody here that is going to do something. They're going someplace. They're going someplace else where there's where they're getting out of this storm they've been in some sort of situation where there's been a lot of you know it's been cold and dreary and it's time to go some get the hell out of there by the looks of things um going somewhere taking action going somewhere going going to help somebody because it's it's the knight of wands the six of swords the five of pentacles and the king of wands so it's like some and this king of wands looks like he's saving somebody or something
This is a hero of some sort or something like that. Protective, decisive, a decision maker, fearless. This is fearless. I mean, if you're, if you're going to go hang out with some bats and go into a fire, then, hey, you got to be fearless. I don't know. Maybe it's the fireman. Whoever this person is, they are coming in the nick of time by the looks of things. Before it's too late, before it's, before it's, before it's dead, right? You have somebody here that needs help by the looks of things and it feels like they're, they're about to get some sort of, somebody is, a, I mean that Knight of Wands is an, is an rival, right? Queen of Swords reversed. Now the Queen of Swords reversed can be cold, very, very cold, uh, brash, assertive, harsh. Um, challenging, very challenging. Five of Cups on the bottom. Somebody has, has been having regrets. They've been thinking about the past. They've been thinking about the choice that they need to make. They've been reluctant to move on. They have another opportunity for love that has been right in front of their face that they, that they have been ignoring. We have somebody here that may need to replace their fear with faith to deal with this person that they, I don't know, need to help. This person needs help, but there's some sort of, I don't know, fear. Maybe it's fear of being told no because of the magician reversed. There's other options. Maybe there's fear of the other options. I'll be rejected. Because there's other options here. I mean, there's definitely other options here. You could have a lot of regrets if you don't take action right now. This is a card of regrets. Somebody needs to take action right now. They probably have not been communicating. They've abandoned somebody. I mean, that Empress Reverse, she's uh, in some sort of pain, obviously. Could be exploring other options. Somebody's exploring other options. That's for damn sure. I mean, the Queen of Swords in, in reverse, or even upright, is very hard to deal with. This is somebody that will put you right, very sharp-tongued, very authentic, very truthful, does not put up with any type of bullshit whatsoever. But the Queen of Swords in reverse can also be following the heart. You know, we may have somebody here that is following the heart that needs to open their heart. Next to it is the Four of Pentacles reverse. That's opening the Queen of Swords reverse, opening the heart. Somebody needs to open their heart. Now the Empress reverse could be somebody that's closed off, that isn't open to love, to giving love, that isn't emotionally available because she doesn't trust. Behind it is the Ace of Swords reversed. And the Queen of Swords in reverse has probably been hurt really, really, really bad, which has turned her into a bitch, you know, but you don't become a bitch. And the Empress reverse can certainly be a bitch. You don't turn into a bitch for no reason. There's a reason behind that. But there ain't nothing love can't heal. Open the heart. Somebody needs to open their heart. Knight of Wands, act now, think later, just do it. 
get moving, do something crazy. Follow your heart. That's crazy, isn't it? It is. It's really, really, really crazy. Mmm. Death reversed. Something isn't over yet. It's not over yet. Fool. This is crazy. This is foolish. This is replace your fear with faith. Step forward in blind faith. Start over. Remember I said that a minute ago or however long ago it was. This is about starting from scratch, starting over, starting from zero, just doing it. Stepping into unknown territory, doing something crazy. This is exciting. This is an exciting new beginning. Something, this is crazy, but... This is like, it's nearly over. Now that death card reversed is right next to the King of Wands, the near-death experience. We, you know, there could, there could be an incident here where somebody leaves something behind that has really troubled them and they follow their heart towards something more passionate and exciting. It's just spur of the moment with the Knight of Wands. There is like a near-death experience here. There is. It's And near-death is like... It's just about over. The time is now with that Knight of Wands. I do think we have somebody here that is about to, you know, run in a new direction. It's like they're running. They're running. They've been trapped. They've been held back by fear. They haven't been communicating. They haven't been awakened. There's also, some, also something not waking up. It's like somebody has been refusing to wake up, refusing to see, you know, what was right in front of them. But there is some sort of arrival. This is like help arriving, coming to save the day. If, and this could even be some sort of financial help for some of you with that five of, five of pentacles. It's right in the middle. That's hardship. There's financial hardship here. There is somebody here that can help financially. But action, action needs to be taken. Starting from scratch, stepping into unknown territory, leaving it all behind and running in a new direction. This is a starting a new journey. It really is. It's starting a new chapter, breaking free from something that has restricted them. Eight of Swords. Somebody has been confined. They've been staying put in a situation that was safe. But this is absolutely, positively stepping outside of the comfort zone right here. This is, I'm out. I'm out of here. I'm leaving it. I don't want it. You keep it. Goodbye. Bye. Going towards a new life. This is definitely the start of a new life. The fool is the beginning of a new journey. So we do have a new journey that is beginning. Action is being taken. Knight of Cups. Looking for love, looking for romance. Expressing feelings, following the heart. Somebody is following their heart in a new direction. They're traveling in that direction. They are going towards love. It's very sudden. It is a sudden decision. Could be a, a sudden departure that leads to a new beginning. It's like a, it's like a, I gotta go. You know, I'm leaving the rest behind. That's what the journey, the fool starts the journey, doesn't take the baggage. You keep it. I don't want it. Goodbye. Bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. A choice is being made.
We have a hero here that is taking charge, that is taking the lead, that is taking control. Good luck.